All right, so we are back. Lauren Tesla, another video. We are doing the same roundabout testing. Now, uh, just downloaded 12.3.6. I had 12.3.5 for about half a day uh, until I got this new one. So I didn't get to do a video on uh, 3.5. So this is 3.6. Uh, so no change really in behavior in uh, that first roundabout. Uh, not that I'm expecting. And really, uh, Elon's mentioned that these uh, small increment changes, like from 0.4 to 0.5 to 0.6, they're really minor changes. And uh, the big one's going to come with 12.4. But anyways, uh, like I said, I've yet to have a perfect drive with these uh, with this route in terms of that specifically that last roundabout. So uh, these roundabouts right now are pretty easy. Uh, it really does a good job now. Uh, slowing down and really just kind of going through the roundabout without any issues whatsoever. Uh, so obviously no traffic today, uh, so it's really an easy job. So right now I do have the auto speed setting on and we're going 39, which is a little slow. Uh, this max speed is 40. So we are approaching this stop sign on the left. Oh, sorry, straight ahead. Um, so we're going to stop at a good spot. This is exactly where the stop sign is. So this is where we're supposed to stop. It's kind of a blind left over here. So we're going to creep up. Car just passed. And we're good to go. So definitely good behavior. Not slowing at all. Um, not hesitant, really. Uh, there's someone behind me in that situation. I don't think there'd be any sort of issues. Uh, so slowing down up here for construction. We are going to go just over the white line into this new lane without any issues going 48, following the car in front. I don't know if you guys follow me on X, but I did post a video recently about a car who went in the wrong lane. So went into the opposite lane coming because it was confused. So, you know, humans are just as much as, as fault as FSD. Uh, you know, every single car crash up to date has all been a human fault. So, um, you know, FSD is not robot taxi yet. It's not full self driving. It is full self driving supervised. You are supervising what it's doing. It's in addition to what you are currently doing. Uh, so no, I'm not expecting it to drive by itself. I'm expecting it to, uh, basically another layer of safety, another layer of driving on top of myself. But at the same time, it's going to be driving a little bit differently than what I'm used to or than what I would do. So we're approaching the first big one here. Uh, we are making a right turn. I'm going to do full screen and get rid of this thing. So you can see the cars coming here. So we have two cars up here. Those are in the left lane. Uh, so this middle lane that we're going into is clear. So it should be going soon. So here we are. So this is the roundabout that it constantly messes up on. Uh, coming up so we'll see what we're doing so we're supposed to be in this lane uh and then stay in this lane throughout the roundabout and then kind of like in the process of going into the right lane so we're slowing down there is a mazda or toyota just coming up so we're going to go in so we're supposed to be in this lane so it's not So we were supposed to go there. Don't know what it's doing there. So it was going to try to squeeze back in. Uh, so same behavior on that last one. Uh, I kind of let it do its thing. And as you can see, I tried to revert back to when I realized it was in the wrong lane. I tried to go back, but I think it was uh, just too little, too late. So we have another Tesla coming up.
So we're gonna take the roundabout from another viewpoint or from another direction. So there it is, fine on that one. So totally dependent on, and I've gone uh, the other direction before without issues. So it's basically going in the direction that I was that I was going where it messes up for whatever reason. Uh, so hopefully that gets addressed soon. So I'm just gonna go into an auto park situation here and just demonstrate a bit of auto park. So as you can see, like I said, it uh, messes up in that one specific area over and over again. Um, but 99.9% .9 of the drive is absolutely fine. Uh, zero issues, zero, uh, like it's very human-like. So, you know, if I'm getting that from the software, then I definitely think it's worth it. I'm not expecting it to be a robotaxi. This is not what this is. Uh, so if it, just from that little six minute drive, if it does five minutes and 50 seconds of that drive, and all I have to do is basically take over that one intersection and drive from here to there to get it to auto park, uh, that's definitely a win in my books, definitely progress. Uh, so yeah, there it is. Uh, if you like this video, definitely give us a thumbs up. Uh, let me know in the comments if you think I should improve on the presentation and whatnot. Um, yeah. Anyways, in the meantime, uh, thanks for driving, or thanks for watching. And uh, let me know what you guys thought. The FSD trial is coming up to an end for most of you soon. So let me know if you guys tried FSD and uh, how you liked it, what you thought. And uh, yeah, we'll catch you next time. In the meantime, drive safe and drive electric.